come to Dublin today, you'll hear the story of Darkie Kelly. Now, the interesting thing is, of course, she's celebrated here in Fishamble Street, in the Cobbler Alley, in the Harding Hotel, and indeed part of the uh, pub being called Darkie Kelly's. The real story of Darkie Kelly, or Dorcas Kelly, is far more interesting and indeed far more dark and grotty than uh, the surroundings behind me would have you believe. <laughs> In fact, the story really takes us to here, a very unsalubrious part of Dublin in the 18th century, called Copper Alley. For it was here in Copper Alley that Dorcas Kelly ran a brothel called the Maiden Tower. In 1760, she was accused of killing a shoemaker called John Dowling. The authorities were alerted, and uh, unluckily for her, her brothel was raided, where they found five more bodies in the basement. The site of the Maiden Tower brothel is no longer here. It gives you an indication of the kind of narrow street in 1760 that it would have operated on, how close it is to Fishamble Street and the trading heart of 18th century Dublin. But because there are accusations of witchcraft involved as well, she was not only the most prominent serial killer in 18th century Dublin, but she met one of its most grisly fates as well. But she was taken from Copper Alley by the authorities and taken to a place of execution on Gallon Street, which is now Baggett Street, where she was executed. Gallows Street by partial strangulation and being burnt at the stake. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed um, that very, very quick uh, look at spooky goings on here. And if you did, uh, please uh, like and subscribe and join me next time on the 32nd Historic. Bye.